picks of the week. This is something called a spider. Okay. Uh, it's made by uh, uh, a great company. I forget the name. Uh, Data Color is the company. Mm-hmm. And what this is is a monitor calibration device. Oh, and what really the, cool. And this, and this is a very important tool. If you do anything with video or pictures, especially pictures, uh, it's very important that your monitor is showing the proper color gamut. And what will happen from time to time is the colors on your screen will, your reds won't be looking like they should. Uh, your blues won't be looking like they should. So how this device works is here, I'm now going to show you the back of the device. And the back of the device, as you can see, has this kind of a screen thing. And it's got these three little feet. So what this does, and I'm going to demonstrate, say my hand is the front of the monitor. Mm-hmm. You throw this over the back of the monitor, the cable. And then you kind of tilt your tilt your monitor, you know, aim it back a little bit, okay. and so this is flat up against the, your screen. You run the software. It takes about say five minutes, and you run your make sure you run it when your monitor's been warmed up for a half an hour. Okay. And what it will do is you will create a monitor profile for your screen. So now, and you'll have a little button that you can switch between uncalibrated and calibrated. And you will see the skies that are blue, whites are white. And it automatically calibr- it, it'll change the color of, uh, you don't need to fiddle around with the actual monitor. Right. All you want to do awesome. is set the brightness of your monitor at your normal viewing level. Make sure your lights are on at your normal viewing level. Make sure your monitor has been warmed up. It works for CRTs and LCDs. And what it will do then is create a custom color profile. So every time you boot up your computer, you actually, it will load this profile, and your colors will look correct. That's actually uh, awesome. I, I, you know what? I need one. How much is that? The great price. Now, I picked this up uh, about a year and a half ago for eighty nine dollars. Wow, it's that's called great. The, it's called the spy. Here's the box for it. It's the. It's called the Spider Three Express. Uh, now, there's a couple of extra. There's higher up versions. There's a pro version, and there's like even a higher version than that. Really, for just for what you and I do, if you're just an entry level, even a medium level, just just you know basic stuff. The Express, the low entry one, is the one you want. It works yeah, on Macs is... and PCs. Uh, it works great. I I calibrate my monitors, and it runs in your system tray. And it'll even remind you that you should recalibrate every you know three months or however you set it. Now, for. when it's you when you calibrated. Tool. Uh, yeah. I'm sure you calibrated for your video for what you're using. Did you notice a difference where you're like, wow, I can't believe how wrong the biggest, it was? Yeah, the biggest thing I've ever noticed is uh, the whites become white. Uh, before, whites had this kind of a yellowish tint to Which it. Which I have the same problem on my monitor. The, you know, the Samsung, I have a Samsung monitor here, and it's a right. really warm monitor. And yeah. if I pull up in Microsoft and Windows, you know when you pull up like the, the picture preview? Yes. When it pulls that up, it's orange in the background. Yeah, yeah. Now, now this can't solve hardware issues. So if your monitor is going out and there are some issues with your monitor, it can't solve that. Mm-hmm. But what this can definitely do for you is make sure that your colors are correct. And what it will do is in software, it will adjust con uh, it'll c- adjust your contrast and your color balances and everything to make sure it's proper and correct. That's awesome. That's uh, a great pick. Yeah, I love this thing. I've had it for a couple of years, and I just I, I, I run it on my monitors. I have a Mac and a PC, and it runs great on both.